After years of building cookie cutter libraries, we finally have one that lives up to the Chicago reputation of American architecture. The city has finally broken the library mold with an elegant branch in Chinatown. Fundamentally, it's a rounded triangle of steel and glass that's lined with bronze aluminum fins. It's really everything that its predecessors are not. It is very tailored to its physical surroundings and its cultural context. Simultaneously, inside it is a vessel for stirring and emotionally responsive spaces. There's an abundance of natural light uh, pouring into the reading spaces and the public realms. Fortuitously, this hole in the donut, atrium in the center, uh, harkens back to a traditional Chinese home, which encompassed a courtyard. I think it reminds us that public buildings can be just as inspiring and beautiful and innovative as private buildings. It would have been very easy or obvious to just come in with a rectangular, very efficient building, but it really would have been out of place on this awkwardly shaped site. And the commissioner invited design teams to really think outside the box and the design build team at SOM is no stranger to thinking outside the box and really did a fabulous job marrying the form with the immediate environment. It has a very strong civic presence. You would not mistake it for a cookie cutter retail box of any sort. This piece of elegant architecture also reminds us that it doesn't have to break the bank. Coming in at under $2 million, the building has been attracting about 1,500 people daily. That number really proves that architecture can transform and revive uh, a neighborhood because it represents a two-fold increase in visitors uh, over the previous location. Of course, numbers are only part of that story. Patrons love the building, and that is one of the most important things that could be said, after all. Uh, we as designers aspire to make pleasing spaces for people.